<laughs> Watch it. Oh, dear. Well, our next guest won the North American Bird Calling Championships at the age of only seven years old. Let's take a look at some of his work. Amazing, I think you'll agree. Well, here he is to perform for us. Please welcome Tommy Childers. <laughs> Hello? You, uh, I'm sorry, are, are you Tommy Childers, or? Well, that was footage from when I was seven. Uh, a long time ago, the last ago, I guess. time I was on television. The last? And I wow. won the competition. I was number one in the world. Biggest in the world. Yeah, I bet. Well, let's catch up on what you've been doing lately, then, uh, since you used to bird call. <laughs> Himalayan snowcock. Great. I, I mean, I'm assuming. You can assume it, because you know I'm number one. Great. That's uh, it's impressive. Look, I, I wanted to talk about bird calling in my career, but be honest with you, the job situation in America has not been very good. I don't think we need to get into that necessarily. I, I, I mean, I think we booked you on the show because of your bird calling abilities. Uh, oh, you did? <laughs> Peruvian booby. Good. It's good. It's a good feeling to be the best in the world. Just wish I could get some work. Well, what do you do? I mean, what is your line of work? I'm a bird caller. I mean, you were a boy bird caller. I was a yeah. boy bird caller. Now I'm a man bird caller. Jungle bush quail. I can do every one. Okay, well, let's take it back to birds then. What, what is your favorite bird? I don't, I don't like birds. You don't like birds? I had a bad experience with a bird when I was seven. They thought it'd be fun to take me to uh, meet some birds, and the bird came after me. Came out, just started. You were calling them. Well, he was pecking at me. I think he was going after my dandruff. That's, I would guess, one of the uh, things that happens in your trade is you call a bird and a bird actually. They come to you. Well, that's like saying the woman shouldn't have, she was deserving it because she was wearing, look what she was wearing. Well, she. If she were calling. Calling a rapist, I would admit. Oh, gosh. <laughs> the wandering tattler. Okay, well, we're just about out of time here, Tommy, or Mr. Shalders, so sorry. But maybe you could give us your favorite, your just best, most beautiful bird call. You want my most beautiful bird call? Yeah, I'd like to hear it. Mike put you out of a job. <laughs> <sighs> I will do the white rumped sandpiper. All right, white rumped sandpiper. Close your eyes. Oh, okay. I take you now to Lake Huron in late May around the 28th. Okay. Wow. Yeah. It's a beautiful time of year to be at Lake Huron. Wow. That was incredible. Wouldn't you like to hear that at uh, an auto show? No. A lot of people would.